Hey everybody, it's Kyle Blake and Lily from Growing Up Garden. Today I'm going to show you guys how we mulch our walkways in our raised bed garden. So let's uh, get started. Alright guys, so this is my front yard raised bed garden. And as you guys can see, it's doing really well this year. Uh, we've got tons of tomatoes, zucchinis, and peppers, and we've got sugar cane right here in the front. Um, so yeah, everything's looking pretty good. Pretty happy with it. Um, so let me show you guys the walkways I'll be filling with mulch today, slash wood chips. This is the main walkway that leads up to the house. Um, and I'm gonna show you guys how I've got it set up. It's, the garden is set up kind of in the shape of an E. So I have, I've got three little side shoots that lead in to the garden that I'll be filling with wood chips and then I've got this walkway that leads to the neighbor's side. Let me step back and show you what it looks like and uh, I'm going to give you guys a few tips, the do's and don'ts of uh, mulching and uh, let me get to that right now. Alright guys, so I'm going to give you an example of what not to do in your uh, mulching area or an area that you're trying to mulch to keep the weeds down. Um, you don't want to use this uh, weed cloth that you lay down on the ground to keep the weeds coming up because what will happen is, I mean I, I personally don't think this stuff works because what happens is you lay this down and then people put about maybe two inches of mulch in here and the weeds, you know, the weed seeds just start growing right out of the top of this. They fall on top, they grow out, there's not enough mulch to um, keep them from germinating and then what will happen too with this stuff is that I've seen uh, even the guy at the landscaping supply place where I got the wood chips from he said that uh, when it rains this stuff it, it is uh, the water will go through this but it doesn't go through fast enough so it'll start flooding in your walkways and then all your wood chips will start floating away you know so that's another problem that I have with these. So in order to do this properly, let me see if I can give you a shot of this. This is what your walkway should look like. Uh, I've got it about, it's maybe probably, it's probably about six inches here. Um, five to six inches deep with wood chips and that'll keep your weeds from germinating and popping through and then if you get, you know, occasional weed on top it'll be easy to pop right out. And then uh, What's good about using wood chips in your walkways, over time, you know, maybe three, four years, the bottom layer of these chips is going to be some really rich uh, compost for your garden. So, you definitely, you want to mulch your uh, walkways. The deeper, the better. So, I'm going to start filling my walkways up, and we'll see you guys in a second. Alright guys, I picked up these wood chips at my local landscaping supply company for $43 for a yard. So that's a pretty good deal, so I'm going to start filling this up. Shovel Blake! Hey guys, I got tired of shoveling so I picked up two helpers to help me. I got Blake and Lily's over there filling up the walkway. Let's go see if we can see her. Doing a good job, Lily. All right. Walkway's looking good. That'll keep me from pulling weeds now, now that it's all filled up. Oh, Blake's gonna do it by hand, look at that. Put it in there for me. Good job. <laughs> yeah, I'm filming you. Good job. Oh, careful. Watch the plants, honey. All right, guys. I want to thank you for watching. And please subscribe for more videos like this. And for more videos about gardening. And we will see you guys next time.
You guys are doing a really good job.